Let's talk a little bit about water, because this is the Thirst Project for the Thirst Gala, third annual. How much water do you think you consume on any given day, Josh? And I want this in milliliters. Well, I'll tell you this much. I take it for granted, like I think most people do, and it's great to have things like this to remind us that a billion people on the planet do not have access to clean drinking water. And like children are dying every single day from illnesses that, from drinking contaminated water. Every 15 seconds, one child. I, I, how scary is that? I mean, think how many kids die just while we were talking. At least five. That just got really dark. Which, you know... People need to see that because that's how, because we're raising money tonight. And this is cool. This is like streaming live on YouTube. I don't know if this is... Also. And one of the cool things... And then they'll be like, what? People are dying? And even if people just donate a dollar, which is easy to do. And um, there is, we, we, people can actually go to the thirstproject.org and donate money. They can subscribe to the YouTube channel and uh, we'll be donating 25 cents for each subscriber. So really easy just to get people involved. But one thing that you don't even know you're about to go through, backstage they've done this whole art installation that basically shows everyone the impact of the water crisis in these really cool uh, little installation pieces. So it's a, it's a great way, like you said, to kind of um, relate to the problem better because we... We don't even think about how much water we're consuming on a daily basis. We have access all the time. Yeah, we're, we're so lucky, but there's people who aren't. And it's, I mean, it's just sad. I mean, it should be our right as humans on the planet Earth to be able to drink clean water. Are there any other causes that are close to your heart that you'd like to talk about? or? I mean, there are a, water. a couple others, but while I'm here, I don't want to take away... You know, this is also Take Part TV on YouTube, and, and one of our missions is to, um, to really get the word out through social media about a variety of causes and how people can get involved. So if there's anything that, that is, you know, you're passionate about that you'd like to talk about, by all means. Another charity that's dear to me is Chabad's Children of Chernobyl, which is from the Chernobyl radioactive nuclear disaster in 1986. And there's still, there's kids living there and just getting, just like... With, instead of not having clean water, they're getting radioactive illnesses. And so this charity is, um, I guess, raising money for flights to get them out, to get out of Chernobyl and have healthy lives and have access also just to, because all the plants and crops, like all the food's contaminated, but that's what people have to eat. And it's this, I think they've rescued, since 1990, rescued over like 2,000 children they've been through money they've raised been able to fly them out amazing how did you even get involved in that uh, this sounds surreal to say but through the Spielberg family um, I met Nancy Spielberg and she's this uh, she's very involved in this charity her mom has a restaurant the Milky Way and I go to the restaurant and we were what's it called the Milky Way I did not realize that was a Spielberg family restaurant yeah and uh, oh, Steven Spielberg's mom she's the host and like she's in her 90s and she's still running around like t and talks to all the tables and she's really cute and so I've been going there for a number of years and they're like a really sweet family and I mean she lives on the East Coast and she was telling me one time about this um, charity and they have every year they have a big fundraiser and I've been involved since then there was just a movie the Chernobyl Diaries which is a horror movie which is not true there it depicted maybe the people as zombies or I didn't see it but well that sounds awesome that you're involved in that charity as well and I always think you know obviously these events there's a lot of great food and there's a lot of cool celebrities and they give out stuff but at the end of the day it's nice that we have a platform as entertainers to be able to talk about causes and get people involved and that's the most important thing absolutely I mean it's such a great perk I mean there's other like uh, perks like when I get, I get to go to the Golden Globes or you get the gift bags and that's so cool but then to find out that there's things like this which I think is the, at the end of your life when you're on your deathbed contemplating I got dark again you start to think what did I do and it's like I mean things like this I mean I feel so good about this and I, I, it's just it's a joy. Let's raise some money tonight for some wells in Africa. Let's do that. Let's raise some money.